FTI has a one-on-one -on -one conversation with Zoe about the baby's comments at Rolling Loud. Man, it's a whole lot going on, I'm telling you. I I can't keep up, man. I can't keep up. Um, it's a lot to unpack. I would love to speak to someone from the community, from the LGBTQ community, if anyone is willing to chime in. Because one thing about all of this cancer culture, what doesn't ever happen is we never take advantage of the opportunity to learn and grow together. Yeah, you know I mean, ain't nobody coming in with a civilized voice without ma malicious intent trying to say, hey, look, this is where we need to come together at. This is what we need to understand. Yeah, you know I mean, ain't no, it ain't happening. It ain't happening. So I will, you know what I'm saying, welcome. I will welcome. Uh, someone from the community to come on live and we can talk it out. Um, because I'm gonna tell you a question I have is: Is this a conversation? Like, is this a mutual discussion? Is it like us sharing the earth together and having to learn how to learn, grow, and live together peacefully? Is that the point? Because what I'm seeing is a bunch of my way or the highway. And if you don't do it the way I say do it, then it's over with. I ain't seeing much, you know. Um, I think. Hold up. Yeah. Yo, what's going on, bro? nothing chilling but okay i get everything that everybody is saying but well, the reason i was the only one speaking you well you and people who are defending are taking up with what he is saying the, the about the situation that's what i mean everybody the people who are defending what was said at that time i don't so, think it's a defense it's only an explanation it was no it was people are standing people are standing in defense of trying to say what was said was right when at nobody that moment it. It, it was not right it was just not right period nobody the reason it that. wasn't right the reason it wasn't the reason it wasn't right or appropriate is because if somebody is straight because everybody can get no matter who you are if True. they were in that if they were if they were in that audience and this person says if you don't if you don't have that it's raise your light up you don't, like I was telling my people, you don't know if somebody just found out they had it and they were just like, you know what, I just want to get away, go to this concert, whatever, whatever, or they're dealing with a friend who passed away from it or whatever. And you say this, it's just insensitive to people. It, I mean, I understand you said they said it in the hip hop club back in the day, whatever, whatever, but- No, it's still present, it's present, just, present, it's present. It's disrespectful. Present, and if I may say, okay, um, and everybody, I, I'm sorry, people I, are saying freedom of speech. It's okay to have freedom of speech. And this is a difference from having an opinion and freedom of speech and being insensitive and disrespectful. Those are two different things. Okay, now listen, when you say the word disrespect, one must intend to be disrespectful. If he says something that someone took as disrespect, but he didn't intend it to be taken that way, it that does, is a, that's, that's wait a minute, it's you. That's me. to it's you. No, I mean, yes, yes, sir. No, I'm saying to him, it wasn't disrespectful yes, to him. I but you can't say, tell somebody. I, I can't what's tell nobody that they, you're right. You're right. I can't tell anybody that they were or were not disrespected. No, I can't. Which he said it, that he didn't intend to be disrespectful. He was saying, uh, uh, it was a, uh, I guess you could call it call and response. Sort of like if you're from California, yeah. If you And it's a part of certain people's shows, it's a part of DJ show. I, I, I just compared it to if if you ain't got no STDs and you're clean, let me hear you scream. I done heard that shit several times. This ain't the first time. So that's what I'm telling you. So in knowing that, I know he didn't yeah, do okay, it so intending to be disrespectful. 
So if he didn't intend to be disrespectful, why are we treating him as though he went into something and did something on and purpose? I'm, I'm not saying canceling him, but I'm just saying once you saw that people were offended, all you had to do was just say, if I offended anyone, I apologize. But then to turn around and say, my supporters know this, and y'all know I didn't mean that. But it's just like you, it was like you apologized, but you still didn't own up to the mistake you made. And when you're a celebrity or you're in a different status of other people, I'm not saying it, just because you're a celebrity, you're better than anybody, but when you're at a, people look at you different. So you have to be mindful of some of the things you say. You know what I'm saying? It's just it's just that simple. I'm not, saying, I'm not saying I'm not saying he's a guy that. and he's perfect and people make, they do, they make mistakes. But just be mindful because now I, that you have put yourself in this position to be a celebrity, now it's like, you know, hey, I, I gotta take and choose what I degree. say. I can understand that to a degree. Uh, I do believe that if you're on stage, kind of like I'm doing what I'm doing for the purpose of the party. Just like if a comedian is on stage, they doing what they doing for the purpose of a laugh. That's just me though. And I can't make nobody else feel like that, but that's just how I feel. Because we look away when white people be in the crowd saying, yeah, and if they catch her and, and if we catch them in the Walmart doing it, it ain't gonna pass, it ain't gonna fly like that. So the stage is off limits. You see what so, I'm saying? Exactly. That's how, that's so just like if it. a white person got on, it's just like if a white person was to get on the stage and say, if you ain't put your lights in the air, you're gonna get a uh, yeah, no, nah, he didn't drop a he didn't drop a derogatory. A but term, it, like, that is like derogatory the, like the F bomb. He didn't say the F bomb. That, that he said is the N word, but he no, didn't no, say no. the F word. It you is derogatory. You don't know. You don't know who is in that in that arena that had a. But why is he responsible for all of that? He's trying to give people don't. a good show. Why he responsible for all of these people's thoughts and concerns and and okay, their so emotions? It's, why why did he become responsible for that? He was responsible okay, for that. Okay, so, so just say if you ain't broke, put your lights up. If you hit a turn up, if you came and join the show. Out, put your lights up. But to but to say if you don't have well, this dead Well, hey, listen, I'm life. not saying I'm not saying I'm not trying to I'm not trying to excuse anything. Because every man is accountable for his own actions. I'm only merely attempting to explain how it could be tangled in some in some uh, uh some confusion and trying to untangle mm -hmm. i feel like anytime we have moments like this this is a teachable moment it's a it's a time for you guys to understand some so, things about us and for us to understand some things about you we understand trust me we understand about y'all because in the in this nah, world you can't do that in this in this world the straight you community is all is supposedly the alpha male honey so we nah, understand ain't got nothing you. to do with that because this is over here too y'all got solid cats it's Sally Cats, this bitch, and it's, 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 it's some suckers who's some straight men, and vice versa. It ain't, don't know, ain't nobody slow like that, bro. Everybody know better than that. Everybody know better than that. But this is what I'm saying, though, no, bro. So you saying if you're a celebrity, you have this elevated, I guess, uh, uh, Because now, because now you're, but wait, like, when, but at when the same you, time, you are, but, when but, you but just please allow me to, allow me to continue. At the same time, to, go ahead. at the same time, we're supposed to be equal. Y'all want us to treat our fans like they are equals. But, and then you want us to have some different kind of set of rules when it comes to other stuff. So which is it? Is we all the same and then we all equal and we all, you know what I mean? Or, or are we held to a different standard and we, and we play by different rules? Which is it? Now, the reason I say celebrities are looked at as a different standard is because when you have a person who's just walking around with just, you know, they're living a regular life, because y'all's life isn't regular anymore, because you have cameras in front of you. You have paparazzi. Everybody got cameras so, with social media. You got a no, camera, I'm I got a camera. When you go, we're talking you on the camera right now. If you were to go out to eat right now, cameras would be like, oh my God, T.I. is here. But when you have a, so you have different lives, different walks straight you have different people uh -huh. so you have to be mindful of all these people and mindsets that are looking up to you me and this hood y'all who live this way so all y'all have to understand no so it's just it's not, and it's that that's how it's that that's how celebrities have to walk around but it's just you have so many people that respect you that when you say something that's inappropriate that they feel is inappropriate it's just like damn this is who i looked up to and they said something wrong you know what i'm saying like so you may have a fan that does have so if a fan that does have you just told them oh if you don't have this 
raise the light up, they gonna be like, what the? See, I think the mis I think the misunderstanding is that you feel I'm trying. I'm not you. This is not. I'm not upset with you. I no, I mean, but it's that not, I'm just trying to get you to understand why people were upset. But I, I'm. It's not that. I don't understand why they're dealing with it the way they are. Yeah, I don't think he should be. I don't think he should be upset, canceled, or they should. I don't think he should be canceled. I don't think they should drop labels and all this other stuff or take away his boohoo Baja man. I don't believe that. I I just feel like he should just be like he should hold himself accountable to understand. Hey, I offended some people, but all that take him down. He shouldn't be rapping. He shouldn't be this. No, I don't believe that. I no. think we can. I think we can agree on that. I think that's some. Um, I think we can definitely agree on that. And just to be clear, so you feel like because he's a celebrity and he has a following, and we have followings, and people hang on our every word, and, and and we have an opportunity to present ourselves in front of far more young people and other impressionable people that we should not make people feel alienated by being sexual, correct? Do y'all should make people feel alienated? Yeah, I'm no, saying I you, don't think you should we make, should make think... them feel strange or feel uncomfortable yeah, about not it, right? Stra they're not strange, because like, like with the booty All right. picture. No, I'm saying, we should, I'm saying we shouldn't do anything that would contribute to making them feel strange for being yes, that way, right? because I feel like they're people just like you. They are, We're absolutely, all and, we love, and we love you guys. We love you, you guys. Do. You do, not are, all are, of them. Man, we love all of you because y'all love You do. Huh? You do, not all of them. Man, no. I mean, anybody who don't love another human being is because they lack love for themselves. You dig what I'm saying? Well, you need so, to tell your home. I, you got to tell your homeboys that because that comment. But, but, but I, 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 I'm only responsible for me. I'm only responsible for me. But look, exactly. this is what I'm saying. But the same way you feel that way about him, uh, not want him to make people who are feel uncomfortable being. We don't want people from y'all community who are in positions where they have followings and where they have uh, uh, access to the youth and people follow them. We don't want them to make straight people feel uncomfortable being straight either. Okay, but listen, if if they're not touching you, trying to... Okay, so you, why, that same, why that same rule don't apply to us? Listen, if they're not, if, if like with Lil Nas' video, how can y'all tell, if, this is what I'm saying, how can people say that that's making you feel uncomfortable because he had guys in a shower? Ain't nobody. I'm not talking no, about me. Did. I'm they talking did. about If you go you. up under that shade room and other people's comments and out of their mouths, people were them. saying that video made them feel uncomfortable and they're forced to. Made me feel it. uncomfortable. But, but I ain't, but I ain't it, it, I'm grown. You don't, no one's it, asking you look, to now, watch Nick it. Look, not responsible for my feelings. So I ain't tripping about feeling uncomfortable. I don't, it don't exactly. matter. So I know how to say, look away. So why did you say uh, we should make you feel uncomfortable? No one's making but you feel But that's what I'm trying to say, the same thing, but it be the same thing it's almost like you know the way it, the way it's put out there a lot of times it's like well you ain't down with this then you know that's it, not true that's it, not, it, it, not it, it, that's i mean not listen true. listen there's been an the attack on the masculinity of the black for general i mean it's documented it's documented zoe these are facts i'm not speaking my opinion these are facts. it's not <laughs> Because the same way, it, it's just like the same way you guys can go out and have a bunch of women in the video, you grabbing her right. ass. I won't want my kids. Listen, 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 listen. You can have two women grabbing each other's ass, you're kissing them. It's all this other gyrating stuff and right. everything. And then you got Cardi B and you got Megan Thee Stallion. They doing yep. all that stuff. But then when you have Lil Nas, who is just being himself, doing the exact same thing, it's, oh, that's wrong. You're forced to No, I didn't say anything. Up. It's not my job to I, say I, what's I wrong. Say I didn't you. say what was wrong. I said I don't I, want my kids watching. What you, I don't want my kids watching either one of them because their minds have exactly, not grown. So that's don't not, watch it. So don't say that somebody's forcing anything. That is, I didn't that say is nobody was forcing anything. I just showed the same way, just like when uh, you, some of the baby's comments could make people who were uncomfortable. Some of... Uh, 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 Let's just put, I'm just using him as an example. Some of the little non X comments and actions, they could make straight people feel uncomfortable, but we all gotta live with each other. But you I know why he I, does the thing do you know why he does the things he do? Because when you're a person, it's like you have to you gotta clap you have to clap back or say some stuff because y'all try to make I'm telling you, 
you try to make saying, us feel like I, ain't we're never, I don't care the bro. straight community tries love to like if you, you look love. at these comments if you look at these comments it's like the straight community tries to make us feel like we're just less than of a person so he's just so. he's confident with who he is as a person so when he clapped back or says something it's I just disagree. to ruffle your I mean, feathers I'm because not... y'all try to always make us feel like we're less than of a person well, listen, I just want to get to a point of conclusion. I appreciate it's not ever going to get there. <laughs> I, I appreciate your time. And I think what, what you did or what we were able to do, have a discussion so we could speak out on the topics of, of, of concern rather than just bash and, and point fingers because that ain't getting us nowhere. It really that ain't is. nowhere. So That's why I think, wish people would let people be them and worry about themselves. Everybody is letting everybody be themselves. Can't That's nobody not... stop you. Can't nobody stop you. That's... I can't stop what you do, what you yeah, do. You can do. be so yourself. Can't I'm can't when I say let you. everybody be themselves, I mean, like, not worrying about what somebody's doing. If this man you wants to be worried about kiss another on the screen, that's him. Worry about what's going on with you. I can't hear. Nobody else say about you anybody. But... I appreciate your time, and I want you to know that you are love, bro. Ain't nobody got nothing against you, man. Oh, I, 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 or, or nobody I, 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 else. It ain't no pressure, bro. It ain't no pressure. I don't know no real stepper out here worrying about the sexuality of another man, bro. You know what I mean? I don't know now. So, love. Peace, love, All right. and respect. Okay. In a minute. Be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Well. I really do appreciate. I appreciate Zoe for coming on and, um, and you know, and sharing his perspective. You know what I'm saying? I think that's solid. That's solid to him. You know what I'm saying? To put the community on his back and speak up on behalf of their concerns. I think that's what's necessary. I think that's what's necessary. That's what it takes. Ain't nobody got no heaven or no hell to put nobody else in. And whether y'all want me to be here or not, it ain't your, it ain't your, it ain't your authority. It's up to God, bro. If God want to be gone, I'd have been gone. So it ain't y'all, okay? It ain't y'all. So with love and respect, I wish everybody have a great, prosperous, productive day. You dig what I'm saying? Thanks for tuning in to 9MAG TV.